evening. The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important events of these days. Today is broadcast. Earthquake strikes Western Armenia. The Armenian Church of Gesaria has been transformed into an urban library. Paris Seval College Museum will celebrate the 96th anniversary of the writer with the interesting events. Genocide against Armenia's Museum Institute to create a database of victims and survivors. Anchors two notable confessions. Balcony built on 7,000 year old fences of Tigranagert. On January 24, an earthquake measuring 6.8 magnitude struck the Sivirchir province of Harbert, Western Armenia. The earthquake in Harbert was felt in Tigranagert, Samusat, and Samsun, and along with the surrounding provinces. The earthquake took the lives of 21 people, 1,030 were wounded, and many buildings suffered too. The Armenian Church of St. Mary, located in the city of Kesaria, Western Armenia, was firmly used as a warehouse, sports center, exhibition hall, and police station. Now with the decision of the city authorities, the church has been transformed into a city library. According to the Turkish source, state officials attended the opening ceremony of the library. Poet, writer, literary critic Baru Sevak, whose numerous and endless works captivated different generations, would have turned into 96 on January 24. Baru Sevak's house museum will traditionally celebrate the writer's birthday by organizing various events. In a conversation with our man press, the director of the house museum, Sevak Kazarian, said that they will lay rest to the writer's tomb, then the students of Zanga Katun High School and the Rotunda Children's Theatre Group will give performances. Referring to the activity of the house museum, Sevak Kazarian emphasis that he has assumed the duties of director for only one year, and during that time some changes have been made. In 2019, the number of visitors to the museum has increased sharply. The museum is also very active on social media platform. The genocide against Armenia's Museum Institute attaches great importance to the creation of the database of victims, genocide survivors, a database of memories, and a database of videos. To meet these goals, the Institute is looking for funding. Director of the Museum Institute, Harutyun Marutyan, stated this at a press conference. Summing up the results of the work completed in 2019, Marutyan stated that he was satisfied with the fact that the Museum Institute had published the two regular issues of the genocide against Armenia studies, started publishing the English language International Journal of Genocide Against Armenian Studies again, hosted several conferences and explored 35 unpublished memoirs kept in the funds. Head of the funds of the Museum Institute, Kohar Khanumyan, informed that the Museum Institute will be hosting a conference and an exhibition dedicated to the 100th anniversary of self defense of the Armenians in Cilicia this year. Following a meeting of the High Advisory Group with the Turkish President, the head of his staff's public service division said that some circles were pushing for Armenian claims on the events of 1915 to split Turkey. He also stated that the issue of the events of 1915 was on the agenda of the meeting headed by Erdogan, and the steps and actions to counter the challenges were discussed. Ankara has made two confessions. First, the Armenian issue is a matter of divisive potential with Turkey, which is a confession that the official Turkish approach to it has at least so much opposition and there is even a danger of division. Next, Ankara is preparing for a strong domestic and foreign challenge on the Armenian issue, otherwise the issue could hardly be on the agenda of a high-level advisory board led by the president. At the same time, the ambitious and daring foreign policy of Turkey's president certainly understands that the Kurdish lively issue, even for Ankara, does not have the profound danger the way the Armenian question seems to have in a calm regime. After all, Erdogan imagines that the Turkish state is built on an Armenian identity that has not yet been abolished by genocide, and that the decades long effort to build a Turkish identity on it has largely been exhausted, and his representative statement on the internal split is at least a subconscious confession. Recently, a balcony was built on a historical fence of the Grand Gert, Western Armenia. Earlier in the lower part of the fence were carried out reinforcement works aimed to strengthen the wall. However, the authorities found that the project called the National Park did not have appropriate permits. These works on the walls of the Grand Gert, considered to be second largest in the wall after the Chinese Wall, contradicts the rules of UNESCO cultural heritage protection. Now, let us represent to your attention a song by Akung.
find the whole version of the song in the official page of Western Armenia TV. This was all for today. Goodbye.